Hello everyone, welcome to the IchimokuCharts.com hourly analysis for the Euro US dollar FX for Tuesday, June 25th, 2013. Well, a uh, bearish uh, first time frame downtrend in this market. The uh, candle we're analysing here are these last group of candles here for the start of today's trading. Um, the final candle here is still currently developing so we can't analyse that but uh, we have a first time frame downtrend in this market some very small uh, black body candles uh, suggesting that there isn't a lot of downside momentum in this market but just moving back to yesterday's trading if we look here around this area this illustrates very well how the uh, pivot point levels are very important to intraday trading and here we see the market trading down to the uh, first pivot point support level and uh, finding support around there the spinning top type candle following a very strong downtrend set the market up for that change of trend back to the upside. The change of trend was very short lived by the market trading to the bottom of the cloud. We also had the middle pivot point level around that area and the Tenkan Sen and the Kitchen Sen, so very, very solid support, uh, sorry, resistance overhead for this market. And it certainly wasn't likely that that market was going to trade up through that level in a hurry. We then saw the market sell off, and uh, that's where we've been uh, trading throughout this day with uh, some indecisive trading here. But this market is now bearish in all three time frames by trading below the cloud, below the Kitchen Sen and the Tenkan Sen, so a bearish market in all three time frames. Uh, the Chica span here is below the corresponding price action, so we're negative in, uh, or it's, the market is, uh, the Chica span is supporting this negativity that we're seeing in the market. Now, um, if this market does rally, and it looks as though we are seeing a rally here from this uh, 130.79 level, and that is an important su support level for this market. If we do rally, we will need to trade through the Tenkan Sen, which is trading around the 130.88 level. But we do have potentially strong resistance at the middle pivot point level at 130.97, and then just above there, we have the cloud trading out around 130.05 and the Kijun Sen trading around 130.07. So it's likely that this market, if it does rally, we will see some selling coming back in around these levels. And as we move further on, that uh, cloud. Um, uh, resistance is going to actually move a little bit higher and as we move through uh, the trading day if the market does attempt to appreciate and can trade successfully through the middle pivot point level we could potentially see a test up to the first uh, pivot point resistance level at 130.131 but uh, not likely that the market will trade up through there to the downside if we do see a bearish breakout down below 130.79 we could quickly see the market testing to the first uh, pivot point support level at 130.44 we have an important support level at 130.25 and then down to the second pivot point support level at 130.12 so uh, a likely scenario here in this market is that we uh, appreciate the sellers come back in and sell the market off back down to uh, one of these levels